Heavenly Father, I come before you today seeking your hand of protection over my life. You are a precious wing that shields me. Cover me with your precious blood, Father. Assign your angels to take charge of my life. Deliver me from every evil plan of the enemy concerning my life. Be my guardian angel and my keeper. Watch over my physical and emotional needs. Grant me the strength, Lord, to overcome every obstacle that comes my way. I put my entire trust in you, Lord. Psalm 23 verse 4 tells me that even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil. You are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. Fight all my battles for me, Lord. Deliver me from every stronghold that intends to destroy my life. I pray, Lord, that you will deliver me from any misfortune that will rise against me. I apply the blood of Jesus over my family and household. Save me from anything that will harm me, Lord. Be my light and my salvation. Take away every fear from my heart. Conceal me in your shelter on the day of evil. Be my refuge and my fortress, my only helper in times of trouble. Surround me with your light. Psalm 178 verses 8 to 10 says that, Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide me in the shadow of your wings from the wicked who are out to destroy me from my mortal enemies who surround me. They close their callous hearts and their mouths speak with arrogance. Protect me, O Lord. Deliver me from all sicknesses and diseases. I speak the blood of Jesus over my life, family, business and household. Order my steps in the right direction. In Jesus' name. I am grateful for your goodness and mercy upon my life. Fill my life with joy and laughter for the rest of my days. Grant me the clear direction in doing your will, that I may remain protected under your wings. Watch over me in every aspect of my life. Isaiah chapter 54 verse 17 tells me that No weapon that is fashioned against you shall succeed, and you shall confuse every tongue that rises against you in judgment. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord, and their vindication from me, declares the Lord. Father Lord, Please rescue me from every evil deed and bring me safely into your heavenly kingdom. Glory be to your name forever. Your word says, Lord, that the fear of the Lord leads to life, and whoever has it rests satisfied. He will not be visited by harm. Put your fear in me, Lord, that I will be saved and protected. Grant me a measure of faith to be able to hold on tight as I await your protection. Thank you, Lord, for your hand of protection over my life. 
In Jesus' name I pray, Amen.